listen, I've, I said to the players in there, look, I could drop you back and go for the nil-nil. I want to see what you can do next year. And I said that, uh, you, of course we want to win. Um, but there's no point me coming in and going, look at Dermot Drummond, he got, a, he got a draw here, he got a point on the last... you got to play like I want, or you, that's where I'm going to take the club. Um, then judge me, you know, six to eight games in, have we changed and uh, have we got the right personnel? And I've just told those guys, it's their livelihoods. Your fitness levels are not there. Um, I've got to look at why, not necessarily at the players, but there's, it's been a long period, so we go out the game. Um, for me, they, they drop off too easily on their level, so we've got to be fitter. There's certain elements of the club where I've got to take forward, uh, i.e. experienced players, that they may do a job for the club over the period of the season, not necessarily playing every game, but in the dressing room. So if they're a good character and they're, they're an experienced player and I can take them with me, uh, that is the, the main thing in football is the, the mentality and the good character. We need a training ground, we need to then get up to spec um, with the players' uh, quarters where they're going to work every day because there's no point in me demanding of them if I'm not giving them, them that right environment, that right expertise for their bodies. If I'm going to be in a job or if I'm going to go out of a job, it's because it's doing what I'm doing, not what someone else thinks or wants. That's life. And I, I fully understand when I come into management the pressure of it and where you get judged and that's no problem with me you know I'll, I'll do my best and Matt Gray will do his best to make Crawley Town a better club again.